a couple are married and the child is born while they're still married, there's automatic joint custody in Ireland. So with regards to divorce and judicial separation, sometimes the court is asked to decide if the parties are to retain joint custody or if one mum or dad are to have sole custody. What we've seen is that in the best interests of the children, which the court has to look at, is that joint shared custody is maintained even after the divorce is granted. No matter what the application before the court, be it in the circuit court or in the district court, the best interest of the child is always at the heart of the matter. What you have before the court is two adults where a relationship is completely broken down. Otherwise, they're not going to be where they are. But in the middle of it are the children. And this is what the court has to focus on with regards to custody, with regards to access, and with regards to maintenance. Adults will point score when it comes to access, maintenance and custody. The court doesn't entertain that. They'll make a decision not on the point scoring that's going on between the parents, but with regards to maintaining and ensuring the best interests of the child. So if there's a maintenance order and it's not being paid, it's something that the courts will take a very dim view on because obviously the initial application was made by the primary care because they needed that extra, extra source of money for the children. If your maintenance is not being paid, you can go to the district court and you can make an application for a breach of a maintenance order or you can seek that a debtor summons be issued against the person who is supposed to but has failed to pay the maintenance. This is taken as a very serious breach in the courts because the court's view is maintenance is for the benefit of the children and again the parents are using it as a point scoring exercise. There is options available, secure them in the district court. So the reason that we hear more about dads paying maintenance is that in the majority of cases mom is the primary carer. So maintenance applications will be made in the district court and it's based on fact. It's not based on, oh, he has a bit of cash or he has this. It's based on fact. It's based on your properties. It's based on your income and what your outgoings are. So there is a measure in the district court as to how much they can order a parent to pay with regards to maintenance. But it's worked out on the facts that are presented on statement of means by both parties, given to the judge, and they'll make a decision. But maintenance is not for the adults. Maintenance is for the children.